Welcome to another Halloween adventure. We're back at one of our favourites from last year. That's York Hallow Scream. Yes. This was amazing last year, so yeah, looking forward to some good yes, things. We We've already done 29 mazes this season, so this is going to take us about 34 or something like that, I think. Um, before we start, I want to say that tonight is sold out. Tonight's sold out? Yeah, it's their first night. Um, we also want to say a huge thank you to Hello Scream for inviting us and gifting us our tickets. Yeah. So we're going to have a great time. Oh, uh, yeah. I was gonna say that looks cool, but I can't get a, can't get a picture of it. <laughs> so this one is along the lines of the other events where you get a card, yeah, and they cross off the mazes as you go, so you can do each one once. Um, don't lose it because if you lose it, can't get you're, another one. You're damn out of mazes. <laughs> um, there is this cool safety brief in this bar, which we'll go into in a minute. So we'll show you that in a second. Interesting, it's so cool. Like to give you all the safety rules, like it's all encouraged, right? it's such a good idea. And then you come out to this bar, um, and there's loads of street actors and things. And then you walk down this. This is my favourite. And there's this eyeball and a sign. It's so cool. I'll show you this in a second. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that, that story is the whole story for the whole thing. Like they all link back to the fact that the circus burned down. Like century and a half ago and stuff, that's how all these things come together. Such a great idea to have a whole story. I love that eyeball. Yeah. And then you come down to this, the party tent. This is where it all starts, isn't it? Great. And there's uh, oh, loads of these burners everywhere as well, yeah. yeah. I tried to get some pictures last time and they didn't come out very well, so I'm going to yeah. try again. Yeah, it's the main hopes. There's a stage. Oh, yeah, that's cool. Oh, yes, it is. Magician, I guess. Yeah, and all, all the houses are up here. Cool. Lots of places to eat. Lots of places to eat. Yeah, that's cool. We'll have a look at merch up in a bit. We'll do that for sure. This is cool. Oh, it's a little DJ box. And then all the mazes, there's waltzes here. And then all the mazes come off these. So we're going to go do Barn again in 3D first, I think. Is that the plan? Yeah. Yeah, we're going to do Barn again in 3D first. Ooh. Excited. Or oh, maybe it's not 3D this year. Huh? Maybe it's not 3D this year. Oh, yeah, it's, yeah, it's, I can see it. Food is well tripping. Just got super smart. That 
was eight. Oh you got quite loud, like it's really loud in here, but that was it's really It's so disorientating with the 3D. The 3D well. The 3D seems better than it was last year. Yeah, it's like over every wall, like every wall, all the pictures, all the actors, like you don't know if, what's real. If I seem to remember that, it's one of the weaker ones, wasn't it, last year? I, I can't really, we enjoyed it. Like it was a good piece last year, that was really good. Too. That was like, really good. Yeah, you got quite a few. Yeah, you were quite a few. Yeah, we were in the front of the group again, that's that kind of old time. Yeah. Yeah, and they have a lot of like um, animatronics and sensor things, don't they? That's noisy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not, not just like animatronics and sensor yeah. stuff too. So, yeah, I've done that was quite good. Quite a lot of this, it was really like that. It was. Lots of crouching and uh, bending down a bit, so it's a lot with eye textures. A bit, the floors are a bit concrete and wobbly and Yeah, stuff. a lot of unevenness. Yeah. Um, it, was, it was really well themed, it was really good. There was a lot of actors in there, it didn't seem empty. No, you don't really just get started. Yeah. I'm going to go for a fourth for the first one. I thought it was really good for the first yeah. one. But I have so many stairs in there, but I think <laughs> I'm going to go for a four on the Wii scale. Oh, the Wii scale, like, like, that's powerful. I did nearly Wii in there. That's just like, a little bit. Just a little bit. Good job, dude. Good night. We'll see you in the next yeah, one. Catch up. Have a quick sleep in the merch. Because we've got a proper shop this year. It's tropical. Cool. Cut the shackles. Yeah, like each other. Yeah. Cats. Yeah. These are the merch. So we've got some cats here. They're eight pounds. Some beanies are eight pounds. They're pretty not bad, are they? I've got these t-shirts next to me. Yeah, key rings. They're good. They're I've not seen anyone do key rings before. No, that's true. They go on for every house as well. I don't mind with that one. These are the t-shirts. So they've got. Too. Yeah. It's cool. Oh, I like these. <laughs> Horror duck. They're cool. Yeah, They're five pound them bottles. It's not bad, really. No, it's not. Seems like no, there's no sorts of ornaments and things inside. Like gargoyles and they were like gym, gym toys, I guess. It's 75 piece now, but if you saw some sticker on your fridge. Yeah, I just want a bit of a moment. Mapes. I think we've got some stickers here as well. Oh, are they temporary chatter? <gasps> what? Oh, wow. <laughs> they are amazing, right? You look at them far too often. <laughs> yes, I do. Um, I don't know if this is a sticker or a temporary tattoo. It's a temporary <laughs> tattoo! <laughs> Oh, they're like kiwi. Oh, yeah. uh, wristband. Oh, okay, that's cool. They're like school air freshers. They, they've got a bit of everything. This is like just, it's more like a Halloween shop than a merch stand. They've got some nice bits and bobs in here. I like that. Yeah, it's quite cool. Yeah. Wow, this is like the most I've ever looked at merch at any Halloween things. It is. Cool. So, this is the flesh part. It's like cannibals and things. It's 2073, which was epic last year. That was absolutely banging. It was epic. And then down the top, there was the singularity down the end on the left, which is the new one for this year. And then they've got some. Oh, some uh, carnival games. Yeah, and I think you can bring merch on the carnival. Sure. Right? It's interesting, like, shoot the balloon off the top of the zombie heads. That's pretty cool. That one looks fun. Like that, that, that's some coconut shy, that is. Three wings, wings of teacher. Ah, cool. Two wings of teacher, one wings of teacher. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I like these. These are very cool. <coughs> I think if you said worth mentioning, it gets quite warm in here. Yeah, that's why I left my shorts on today. I have a coat and a scarf on it, it's pretty warm. Yeah, that is, that is true. <laughs> so we're going to go to Flesh Pot next. 
bit more like this. That was good. Yeah. I really enjoyed that. It's, it's very like, it reminds me a lot of the pie factory around there, but it's all about pigs and like big use of pies and so you just want to do one big butcher. Yeah. It's good, it's really, really good. I enjoyed that. It's good. It was. It's good it was quite, as well. It's quite long as well. The theming in there is really good. It There's is. There's a lot spot. of latex and heads and legs. Yeah, like heads, lips, hanging from the roof if you have to walk through, yeah. as well as like peacocks or something like that. There's a lot of options in there, it's quite good. And there was some big items in there. Yeah, there really was. Quite a few, few good scares in there. A few really good scares, a few surprise scares as well. Yeah. They, got, they, they took use of the strobe in there as well. Yeah, a couple of good things. There's actually good yeah. strobe in there. The air blowers with the curtains. A couple of bits get deaf in the song, which is like barrels cracking everywhere and stuff like yeah. that. Probably noisy. It's good. Three and a half. Three and a half. I'm going to go three and three quarters. I think. Yeah. I think it's quite as good as fun to get everything through good. Yeah. Make a wee wee. Two and a half wee wee. Send me schedule. Cool. It's too bright. There's loads of food. Just decided what to get. We have some dirty fries. We've got the cheesy bacon ones. It's about four or five quid, depending on which flavour you want. And we're going to get pizza and do a bit of sharing, aren't we? Yeah. Show, show you these before they get devoured. That looks good. It does look good. Put the bacon on it as well. It's because that's just come out of the flesh part, that's why. Yeah. <laughs> and we went for barbecue chicken pizza. Yeah. Just looking at this, like churros and sauce. Look at the size of the flash bros, they're massive. Look at they're huge! This also looks great. Look at that. Barbecue chicken. That's big pieces of chicken on that beef. Yeah, it is. Into the bar. Refundable to buy cups. And this is our local beer, I think, our bars and things, so have a look. I like the beer. It's a bit... <coughs> the beer list. It's 4 25 for hours. What was the cider? Um, Five there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, five pound for a pint now, yeah, star for 4 for dark foods. Try. Dead man's fingers, yeah. I wasn't too bad really. So there's two pound pies on the cups. Um, you get back when you take them Yeah, you got it's a bottle of Diet Coke, you don't have to splash it. So it was 13 quid, 13 pounds something. So nine pounds for the two drinks, which is alright yeah. for these events, alright? Not many places are wondering characters have a chainsaw. So, back to it, next up, down to Corny's. Is it Corny's Corny Evil? Yeah, I think it is. I can't remember if it had a different name. I thought it was like Corny's Revenge last year or something. That was cool, I really enjoyed that. That yeah. was really good. It's a proper like pretty fun house though, isn't it? I think so. Yeah. And then they, and Halloween I think so. 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 I think I kind of good. And again, these are good bags. I don't feel like it was not enough, but like, we didn't want too many empty spots. So yeah, it's good. Yeah, okay. I think it's the strongest tonight. I think it's. But that could be down to us not being a big fan of clown raising. I'm a big fan of it. You just always sit out of it. That's good because it's got the funny outside of it. Yeah. It's better than some That's of one of the better clown raisers, definitely. I think it's got wise. 
three and a half today. Yeah. I don't get three and a half. It seems good, but the other two are probably. Two solid. Yeah. Two more left. We're going to start by Singularity. I love that, that's epic. What's in that? I don't know, it looks like a bottle, don't you? I mean, you think it's got some lights in or something, but I don't know. It's cool. Oh, she's there. I found you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> 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 there's something dead with that one. Oh, that, that was quite good, but at the end, there's so much smoke in that last room, everyone's coughing through that. My eyes are watering. <laughs> I actually couldn't breathe or get my words out, that was a bit too much smoke in that. There's some really good tricks in there, it's quite a good maze actually, like the, the physical maze, like, there's lots Look of bits where you... Look at coming out choking! <laughs> yeah, there's like lots of bits where you have to duck and you crouch and you go through and yeah. tricks with like, they can't use that side where it's funny how through the side it's quite clever, like... We got split up a bit at the beginning. Yeah, we got split up at the start, like not as much as last year when it was the 1-0 binary maze, but they still use that and it's, it's quite good, it's quite good. It was a good maze actually, them girls behind me were hanging on my own. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I, I quite enjoyed that. The only thing that let it down was that smoke for me at the end, I just couldn't breathe. Yeah, it's just like a little bit... I don't have asthma or anything, but that really did irritate me in there. It was just a little bit too much, like you've got no option to breathe and walk through, but you so, can't see where but you go. do you know what helped? I started breathing through my nose. Right. Breathing in and out through your nose and it, it stops it getting at the back of your throat. Take a gas mask. <laughs> what are you going for for scores? I'm not sure, what do you think? I think we're going to go for a four, I think. Yeah. I, I thought it was a good mate, it's good. Like, yeah, I'd say four. Scare-wise, I think a three. Yeah. yeah. That's good. It's a, we really enjoyed that one. It's a nice, nice choice. A few different things that you'd normally see in the maze. Like a quasi maze, you just kind that of is, That is actually a very unique maze. Yeah. I can't say I've done a maze remotely similar to that. I, I thought it was going to be more of the mannequins and wheel and not when we saw some of those bits at the end. And I thought you were going to be absolutely... I was freaking out. I was freaking out, but I don't know if some of them were real and just didn't jump out at me. Possibly, possibly. I don't know. We could certainly use that a little bit more to some back because it is good. We're rough. We've yeah, got so one more left. 2073. This is our favourite last time, which is why we're doing it last. And it was absolutely epic. Like it, it was that was a long maze of fairness, but this one was a long maze. Like I must admit, all the mazes here are lengthy. Yeah, except for the clown one, Corn Cornival. That is that was, the shortest one. It's, short, it's not too short. No, so no. five, six minutes maybe. Yeah. Oh. The other ones are a good eight, nine minutes, I'd say. Yeah, probably. Probably. Yeah. We're not really timing them, but uh, yeah, that, that was that was long. Yeah. This one. <laughs> we'll see you in 20 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Babes, see that film we just watched? In the tall grass. I mean like, it's just a combine harvester, nothing to see here. What? See, where's the proper fire engine? We need a moment. I'm sweating. That was real. I love that one. That is absolutely brilliant. That is the theming in that maze is probably the best theming of any maze we've been to. I think I'd agree with that actually. I was going to say the actors, well, the actors in there are oh, the best. Even to the point there was a guy, one side of the truck, he was like, get out, get safe. And then, and then he shook his head out the other side of the car, and he was a zombie. And it was just like, yeah, and I mean, like, how many mazes have a combine harvester, a fire engine, ambulance? It's like props, sets, mental. Really, really good. Really good. Um, I would say it's really long. It's a good long maze. The bit outside of the cold maze is really disorienting as well because it's so long. It's just, and it's like the strobe, the, the strobe well. and the, the corns are like eight feet tall, maybe as well taller than me. So you, you've got no idea of seeing anyway. I want to say four and three quarters. Oh, I'll give you a four and a half. It's the best one side by a long way. Yeah, that's still my favourite. Yeah, yeah. Favourite and the speed scale, probably the bird three and a quarter. 
of water. It's alright, it's not too bad. Yeah. It's just a lot of it's a lookout. Yeah. It's one of those games where you get some scares, but then you're like, ooh, ooh, yeah. is, is that a combined You know what, stuff? I'm going to refreeze and put three and a half, I think. Yeah. yeah. Good ice Yeah. That's good. My glass is steaming. <laughs> So yeah, we're gonna just take a last one to food. We've kind of done all the mazes, so we see what we see on the wall. Yeah. So the atmosphere here is mad, like. It's great. Because it, there's a DJ up there, and it's all in one big tent, so you can hear everyone's laughs and screams and chainsaws and music. And what's up there? There's a bubble machine. Bubbles, with smoke-filled bubble machine. Yeah. See, smoke-filled bubbles, mind blowing. So yeah, it's, it's worth noting like it's 10 past 10 now. <laughs> and the monsters are loose. Um, it's 10 past 10 and all the queues are quite quiet, so as people start ticking off the mazes. No, no, 2073. It's 2073, that's still quite a huge queue. <laughs> but yeah, all the others were like, they, they, they're loads quieter than they were now, so. Oh, look. I think, I think what I'm trying to say is don't worry about not getting them all in. Because they're not really busy now, so I think you'd be alright. They do the RIP tickets, which give you like a fast track. They, uh, they might be worth it depending on the price. Um, yeah. We'll put the link down here to obviously where you put your tickets and that. I'm yeah. not too sure how much the add-on to the RIP is. If it's a busy night, I'd say it's worth it. Tonight was sold out. We did have RIP tickets, but I'm not sure if they were just given no, to no. Um, press or events. Because the RIP queue was dead, it was straight walk on. But yeah, like, it's, yeah. it's 10 by 10 now, it's still open till 11 or half. 7.30. It's still open for another hour and 20 minutes, and there's not a lot of queues. So Some of the busier nights, I've given an extra intake. So I think the last intake at the moment is 9.30. 9 or 9.30. So it's not too bad. Yeah. 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 They've, they've turned the five now, so I can't get a picture of it. But. And then just out here on the left, there was a cafe before. So if you want to be a bit quieter, just in this building here is like a little sit down area. <laughs> the toilets are as you come out of the. Yeah, the right at the top. And some of these guys are great. <laughs> yeah, just in here where it's the exit. You can go in the front, and there's just like a little sit down area. Inside. But if you come here, there's like... Yeah, it's like a little spooky. I don't know if there's... I think there's a little yeah, bar Yeah, just, just a little sit-down area. Yeah. Right, Gord. Yeah. So that's just out. Oh, that was so good. It's such good. a good event. Like, it really is. I'm really surprised, like... like that. I don't know, it doesn't seem very well heard of. No. It is, clearly loads of people that are local turn up, but it seems a very local thing. And I mean, you think Tully's gets its name out, and loads of people go down to Tully's, and loads of people go to like Friday nights, and this seems to be on its own, like. I know, I, I, I know, I know what you know mean. About it. Nobody else yeah. does it. It's absolutely it's, cracking. It's a fantastic event, it's well organised, it's got great, unique mazes, great actors, great food, great atmosphere. Great atmosphere, I like that. Because it's all in that one big tent. It's very like, if you've been to Dr. Fry, it's very like that. So all the queue entrances yeah. are off this one hub. So everyone, as I just said in there, everyone, you can hear the screams, the chainsaws, the people chatting, the, the stuff that's going on on the stage. You know, I, the, I can't fault this event. <laughs> No. I can't say there's anything about this fan that is poor. No. I can't. My, my biggest gripe is the fact we've parked all the way down the car park. <laughs> hey, That's we should have gone here anyway. That's what it anywhere. is. <laughs> <laughs> it's been absolutely fantastic. So, really enjoyed it. Are you going to crack it a score out of 10? I think I'm going to go for like 9 and a quarter out of 10. I'm going to go 9, I think. Yeah. I'm going to go 9. There's not a lot of stuff in here really from being a 10, but I don't think we can give a 10 till we've done everything. Yeah, that but then sense. you might not find something that is a 10. Well, then it still works, it's got 9s. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'd definitely go with nine and a quarter there. It's, like I said, there's there's not a lot of stuff in it being a ten. Um, no, the, the, the mazes are all top quality mazes. They are. The food was really good. The, the price wise, cheapest place for a beer at four twenty five. Yeah, nice drinks as well. They do bottled beers and ciders. Yeah, they're like draft lager. Um, different drinks. spirits. Like I had, I had a, um, dead, man's a dead man's finger rum, which is a different spirit that you don't often get. 
So yeah, it's been absolutely amazing. Yep. So we're gonna say thank you to Hellas Group again. Yes, thank you for us along. so much. It's been absolutely fantastic. I would recommend anyone looking for a good night out and enjoys Halloween for events. Sure. Make sure you check this place out. Like I said earlier, all the links to the park are gonna be below. Yeah, they'll be in the description. For your tickets, I think it's on for up until Halloween now, isn't it? Yeah, it seems everywhere. They run pretty much all the way until Halloween. And it's the eleventh. It the weekend after as well. It's the eleventh today. Yeah. So from the 11th all the way up to Halloween, they're doing most weekends, I believe. So definitely check it out. Thanks for watching. Thank you, bye.